Jay Williams was one of the best college basketball players of all time, but he only played one season in the NBA, so what happened? In high school, Jay Williams was named a McDonald's All-American and committed to Duke. Over three seasons, he averaged 19 points and 6 assists while being named a three-time All-ACC player, two-time Consensus All-American, and winning the 2001 National Championship and 2002 Player of the Year, Wooden Award, and Naismith Award. Because of this, in 2002, he was drafted second overall by the Chicago Bulls. After making the 2003 All-Rookie Team, that June, Williams was riding his motorcycle at over 70 miles per hour without a helmet or motorcycle license and hit a street light. He suffered a severed nerve in his leg, tore three ligaments in his knee, including his ACL, and fractured his pelvis. After the injury, he was in the hospital for almost three months. During his long and grueling rehab process, Williams became addicted to alcohol and the painkillers that the doctors were giving him and suffered from severe depression. In 2004, the Bulls waived Williams and effectively ended his basketball career, but he used this incident as a lesson and rebounded from it. Now, Williams works at ESPN and has a radio show, so what would Jay Williams' NBA career have looked like if not for this tragic incident?